Welcome to our coding tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with databases. Our viewer wants to know how to insert a list of objects into a SQL table using Dapper and C Sharp. Let's dive into the details. The question is straightforward. Our viewer has a class called My Object and wants to insert a list of these objects into a SQL table without iterating through each item. They want to know how to achieve this efficiently using Dapper. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Let's get started. To insert a list of objects into a SQL table using Dapper and C Sharp, we need to ensure our SQL command is structured correctly. Let's start by modifying the SQL insert statement. Next, we will use Dapper's execute method to insert the entire list in one go. This is done by passing the list directly to the method. Now, let's ensure that our save list method is correctly structured to handle the list of objects. We will also need to ensure that the connection is properly managed. Finally, remember to handle any exceptions that may occur during the database operation. This will help in debugging any issues that arise. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To insert a list using Dapper.net and C-sharp, you need to pass a table-valued parameter. First, create a table type in your SQL database. Then, set up dynamic parameters and add your data table to it. Finally, execute the command. Here's the SQL code to create the table type. It defines the structure with ID, object type, content, and preview content fields. In C Sharp, create dynamic parameters and add your list as a table valued parameter. Then execute the insert statement to add the data to your database. For more detailed information, check out the link provided. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To insert a list using Dapper and C-Sharp, you need to write a valid SQL insert statement. Make sure the parameters match the property names of your class. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To insert a list using Dapper.net and C-Sharp, you can utilize the Dapper.contrib extensions for simplicity. This method works well for a few hundred records, but for larger datasets, consider using school bulk copy. Make sure your entities are named according to Dapper's expectations and have a primary key. You can also add annotations for the table name and key if needed. Here's a quick code example for saving changes asynchronously using Dapper. Open a connection, 
insert the entities, and then close the connection. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To insert a list using Dapper.net in C-sharp, you can use the execute async with retry method. This allows you to transform your data while inserting it into the database. And that's it. I hope that helped find the resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.